Hi my friends and welcome to our classroom. Today we're going to be doing some math. Yesterday I put out a video reviewing the numbers 0 through 9. This video we're going to be moving into addition. We're going to be adding numbers 0 through 9. Now for some of this video you might not see my face but you're going to be hearing my voice. I'm going to be teaching you three different strategies you can use when we're adding. Again, these are adding numbers 0 through 9. So, we can use our fingers, we can use markers, and I also have manipulatives. Now manipulatives can be counting bears, they can be M&Ms, they can be anything that you can use to manipulate with your hands. Alright, let's get into it. We're going to start easy, and I'm going to show you all three strategies first before we do more addition sentences. Here we go. Alright my friends, so the first thing that we have to do is we have to read what is being asked of us. So normally sentences have words. When we're dealing with math, we're dealing with a number sentence. So we're going to read this just like we would any other sentence. We're going to read from left to right. So you're going to follow my finger and read exactly where I point. Let's do it together. This says 1 plus 2 equals. So we have to figure out what does 1 plus 2 equal. The first strategy I'm going to teach you is with our fingers. So what you're going to do is you're going to put up 1 on one hand and 2 on the other hand. Now we count up all the fingers together. Let's do it together. Ready? 1, 2, 3. So 1 plus 2 equals 3. Very good. Here's the next strategy. You can use your marker. When you see the number, you're going to draw little circles underneath it that represents that same number. So if I have the number one here, I'm going to draw one circle. If I have the number two here, I'm going to draw two circles. One, two. Now just like we would with our fingers, we're going to count all of the circles to see how many we have. What I like to do is after I finish counting a circle, I exit out. Watch. One, two, three. Looks like one plus two is still three. The last strategy is using manipulatives. Now remember, manipulatives can be counting bears, can be M&Ms, it can be rocks. It could be anything that you can grab so that you can move around to figure it out. What I have are counting vehicles. So for one, I have a school bus. One. For two, I have these vehicles. A fire truck. And a dump truck. So I'm going to put those underneath number two. So just like we did with our fingers and just like we did with our marker, we're going to point and count to see how many vehicles do we have in total. So let's do it together. Let's use our fingers and do it. We have one, two, three. Very good. Now you know the three strategies used when we're adding. The next example we're going to do is read it with me. 3 plus 4 equals. So we're going to do it all three different ways again. Ready? The first one is with fingers. So put three fingers up and then four on the other one. Let's count how many fingers we have up. Ready? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 3 plus 4 equals 7. Let's do it the second way, with a marker. Let's draw three circles under the number 3. 1, 2, 3. Let's do the same thing for number 4. Draw four circles under 4. 1, 2, 3, Four. Now let's count the circles together. Remember to cross out the circle that we count. 
Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three plus four is still seven. Now we're going to use the manipulatives. Remember, you can use anything you want. I'm going to be using my counting vehicles. So, I'm going to put three vehicles on one side. And I'm going to put four vehicles on this side. Now I'm going to count all the vehicles together. Ready? Count with me. Using your finger, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No matter how we do it, what strategy we use, three plus four always equals seven. This last number sentence is a challenge, and my students know that I love to try and trick them. So this number sentence says, zero plus five equals. Now, here's the tricky part. How do you show zero when we're using the hand and finger strategy? I can't put up zero fingers, so I just keep all of my fingers down. Now, I'm gonna put up five fingers. So if I have zero fingers on this side, and I have five fingers on this side, when I count, I don't count any numbers here, I just count one, two, three, four, five. So zero plus five equals five. All right. Let's do with the marker. Again, how do we draw zero circles? We just don't draw any. We leave this blank. Now let's draw five circles over here. One, two, three, four, five. Now when we count, remember, we still X them out so we don't get confused. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. So zero plus five is still five. Let's do the last strategy. Let's do the manipulatives. So now you're getting the hang of this. So if I have zero, how many manipulatives do I put on this side? That's right, I don't put any, but I have to put five manipulatives on this side. One, two, three, four, five. So, when I count, there's nothing to count on this side, so I go ahead and count those. Ready? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five. So we've tried it three different ways, and zero plus five is still five. Good job, my friends. I'm super proud of you. So now, when we're adding numbers zero through nine, we have three different strategies we can use to figure out what the answer is. Now, you don't always have to do all three strategies. You can just pick your favorite one. If you like to use your fingers, or if you like to draw and want to do circles, or if you like to just grab a whole bunch of stuff in the house to figure out how to add one number to the next number. It's up to you. All right, my friends, that's it for this video. I wish you well, and I'll see you on the next one.